21 minutes away from 8 o'clock, some talented young NBA hopefuls. The Texas Legends are playing their first home game this season. It's Friday night, and it's in Frisco. Fox 4's Dan Godwin's live at Dr. Pepper Arena to find out more. Oh, working it, Dan. Yeah, there you go. Good job. You got some moves. Yes, yes indeed. I do. Yes, they're still with me. And we're very lucky this morning to be joined by two members of the Texas Legends. Here's some small forward Jeremy, center Omar. And from what I can tell, these guys are set up right now in what I'd call a partial 2-1-2 zone. And for a guy like me with natural point guard skills, shredding this formation, not that difficult. What you want to do, of course, come down about halfway, they take the fake, and then you power into the paint and get your own rebound, and in it goes. There you go. Sorry, sorry to show you up, guys. Okay, Mackenzie now, over here, with All Saints Catholic School, has got our extra microphone. We gotta do a quick audio switch here. Back. All right, Omar, uh, the legends this year, you're two and zero on the season, so you have to be feeling pretty good about things. Uh, we're feeling great. We just had a road trip in California and won both games, so pretty, pretty happy about it. Great job, and let me ask you about my skills. Now, I know we came up in different eras. You know, I was back when the shorts were really short. But do you still feel like I, I still have it, right? For sure. I mean, I have an eye for talent, and you, you definitely could play with us still today, I think. I mean, you saw that fake, right? It was unbelievable, yeah. you know. Jeremy, <laughs> Jeremy was off the court. <laughs> well done. Thank you so much, Jeremy and Omar. Okay, this year, home games at uh, Dr. Pepper Arena here in Frisco. Something new and exciting. It's called Raytheon Innovation Row. Kim Parks is with Raytheon. Let's step right over here, Kim. Okay. Oh, and we have more of the kids kind of demonstrating from uh, All Saints Catholic School. Innovation Row, what is it? It's a quick study of the science and math of basketball. So we know reach is important for rebounding and shooting. In this, uh, this case, we get to talk about force, gravity, and motion. Yeah, so it's a series of exhibits, Innovation Row, up on the concourse. We've moved them down here courtside. But it's, uh, it's a way for kids to kind of get interested, science, technology, engineering, and math. Right, most kids wonder if I'm ever going to use this math or science, and we're trying to show them it's in everything you love to do. Right, and we've got some other exhibits down that direction. Here you can, uh, I guess, compare your shoe size with some, well, some Mavericks greats, right? Right, exactly. So here's Dirk's shoes, and you can see there, uh, you, uh, <laughs> you might have to stuff uh, some uh, socks in the end of this. Uh, <laughs> yes, uh, quite possibly. Thank you so much, Kim. And right over here, uh, the owner of the uh, Texas Legends, uh, Donnie Nelson, general manager of the Mavericks. Uh, real quick, Donnie, for those who've never been to a, a D-League game, what's, what's the level of competition they're going to see? This is the uh, highest level of competition in the world outside the NBA. And you'll see the young guns of the Mavericks play and some of the um, international greats and uh, guys that aspire to be in the NBA. All right, Donnie Nelson, thank you so much. Thanks again to the kids from All Saints Catholic School. Come see the action for yourself Friday night at 7 p.m. when the legends take on the Santa Cruz Warriors here at Dr. Pepper Arena. We've got a link to the team and to Raytheon at myfoxdfw.com. Legends try to improve to 3-0 on the season. Back to Tim and Lauren. Are you going to break it to Dan when he comes back that he's not that good? No, he's got game. <laughs> he does, believe come me. Come on, come on. Someone needs to let him down easy. Uh, he, he would put me in my place. <laughs>